We had a very warm Easter. We had a lot of clouds off and on throughout the morning and afternoon, but still very, very pleasant weather. Starting to look just a little bit hazy on some of our live cameras because there's a lot of moisture in the atmosphere. However, no rain showing up on WDSU first warning radar. Tuesday night we may get a couple of showers, but it's looking less and less like that rain is going to be very widespread. Here's the important graphic of the evening because we're looking forward toward the fog that will develop tomorrow morning. We don't think it's going to be overly thick. Let's pause things here at 530 in the morning. Best chance for fog is going to be on the North Shore, but you'll see the visibility is not expected to be greatly reduced. Same case here at about 7, 730. The fog will be limited. It'll burn off very quickly. And by 9, 10 o'clock, that visibility should be relatively unlimited. All right, here's a look at the current conditions right now at Lewis Armstrong International Airport. Very muggy with a dew point at 70, 72 the current temperature right now. Winds from the south southeast at about nine. A little bit breezy today. Still have a breeze in place right now. And actually, it's going to be a little bit breezy tomorrow morning. One of the additional reasons why we don't think that fog is going to be very thick. However, look at this. The moisture has really been on the increase over the last 48 hours. It's going to be another humid day tomorrow. But then low pressure is going to pass to the north of us. It'll bring us a cold front late tomorrow. There isn't a lot of cold air out there, but this is something very interesting. If you're a sports fan, and I grew up in Chicago rooting for the Cubs, opening day tomorrow, 1 o'clock in Chicago, they might get the game in. However, both the Cubs and the White Sox are playing games on Tuesday. Snow. How about Wednesday? Snow. Snow also in Milwaukee, but at least they have a domed stadium, but still. Snow for baseball? I imagine the games are going to be kind of low scoring because it's tough to leg out a triple in your galoshes. Uh, temperatures are going to be very, very warm for us over the next few days. We're going to start close to 70 degrees tomorrow as we get into the afternoon. Those high temperatures are going to get to the mid 80s. Here we are 3 o'clock tomorrow afternoon. Mostly cloudy, high temperature in the mid 80s expected tomorrow. Mid 80s again on Tuesday. Tuesday morning we're going to be tracking this cold front. It'll be moving through late in the day. How much rain is it going to bring us? Not much. 20% chance for showers. I think most of the rain is going to be pretty light. Wednesday, an improving weather day, decreasing clouds, cooler air starts to move in. It's going to be breezy, but pretty comfortable, mostly cloudy. Patchy fog toward morning. We're going to start with temperatures in the low to mid 60s, and then tomorrow afternoon, again, much warmer than normal, 82 to 85 for the afternoon high with mostly cloudy skies. 20% chance for showers late in the day Tuesday. Could have a shower in the very early morning hours on Wednesday, but that rain should be done after sunrise. And then the cooler air starts to move in. 72 Wednesday, 75 Thursday. Mornings in the 40s on the, more shore, on the North Shore Thursday and Friday. But the afternoons, very, very nice. That's your forecast on WDSU.